is time to continue our conquest of Arrakis, Dune, Desert Planet. And we will attack the Harkonnen where their border were the strongest. Here. There was a little screw up here, thanks to some upgrade. Your demonstration of military skills now forces us to assign you to another offensive campaign against House Harkonnen. They have continued to attack our peaceful harvesters and must be removed from the area. And that's all he has to say. So, no movie clips this week, no explanation yes, of the sir. units. Maybe next time. Yes, sir. Since Moving next out. time, yes, sir. it will Reporting. actually make a lot of sense. Reporting. In this mission, Reporting. the only thing Reporting. that's new Apart from the shy Huluts trying to eat my quads, Reporting. is the tank, and I think a tank is pretty is pretty self-explanatory, don't you agree? Reporting. Acknowledge. Reporting. Acknowledge. Reporting. Acknowledge. So, since we have a sandworm right at our doorstep, Reporting. we have to be more careful when scouting for spots. Luckily, there is some spice right around the corner. Yes, sir. Reporting. Let's see how far this rock goes. Report affirmative. Report acknowledged. Report affirmative. Reporting. Ah, uh, there's another sandworm. Reporting. We have to find a spice field that is both safe and lucrative. Oh, and here you can see we have um, large concrete slabs now. Which is a very valuable upgrade. Construction complete. See? It goes way faster. Ah, spice right around the corner. Construction complete. And the worm sign is in the north. Reporting. Acknowledge. Let's see how big this field is before I start constructing. However, a power plant is required anyway. And we're in luck. It's a larger field. Reporting. Affirmative. Reporting. Acknowledge. Construction complete. Affirmative. Lucky indeed. And before you wonder, the last time I played this was years ago, so I had no Report. idea which region looked like what. Report. I was simply Report. picking Report. the one area Report. where the Harkonnens border were the strongest. To rub it in their Report. face that I could destroy their strongest outpost. And there's more Report. spies here. But in all honesty, the sandworm is too close for my taste. See? Yeah, this field down here will be our preferred spice mine. For now, see? That sandworm there worries me. And the thing is, unlike in the one mission where it killed the sandworms, these ones don't stop. They continuously go around hunting. If they would stop somewhere, I could park some units there and kill them. Or, you know, drive them away by getting them to yellow on their hit point bar. But these sandworms seem very agitated. They just crawl around, lurking, and don't seem to stop. Luckily, the spice field down here seems to be out of their reach, or their territory. So, we'll have some cash very soon. Construction complete. So it's time to plan our continued Ready base layout. Deployed. I assume the Harkonnen are somewhere in the north. So constructing further buildings where the refineries are is not the way to go. 
two sandworms on screen. Construction complete. Construction complete. These two worry me. They'll probably get some Atreides units into their stomach before this is over. Reporting. Affirmative. Reporting. Acknowledge. Affirmative. Don't get fooled by the dramatic music, it's nothing going on. Just waiting for some spice. Spice is life. And worm, sand worm. Now, while there's still going on here, let me explain a few things. Report, As I mentioned last video, the AI always has one route they follow to your base to crush you and they will constantly send new attackers over and over as long as they have money Reporting. and as long as their production facilities are up. Affirmative. So the strategy I will employ this time is pretty much the same as last time but Reporting. with one benefit. Tanks do destroy buildings faster. Ah, let's click. But you know what, I don't care. Report affirmative. Ah, uh, more spice. Affirmative. Not sure if this is still in, within reach of the sh of the sandworms. Construction complete. So in order to get tanks, you have to follow a specific build order. Even though it makes no sense, you have to build a light vehicle factory first before you can build the heavy weapon vehicle factory. Warning, worm sign. As I said, doesn't look nearly as good as it does in the Lynch movie. Radar activated. Now we have radar. And we can build walls, as you can see. But... Until we get turrets, walls serve little purpose other than to stop enemies from getting into certain places of your base. Construction. So finally we built the light vehicle factory so we so that we can go on to the heavy weapon factory. Reporting. Let's continue exploring. Acknowledge. Reporting. Acknowledge. And as I mentioned, these sandworms never stay still. See how they crawl around? They just wait for a chance to devour something. Here. This is what we want. We need tanks. Also, if you ask Cyril about his opinion about tanks, he says something like, Oh, they're an excellent addition to your quads and strikes for defense. Again, his House of Treaties seems to be completely hung up on the idea of defense. Reporting. Even Reporting. though they're just as war-driven as the other houses are. Ah, he got my trike. Not gonna say the prayer, even though you are a maker. So this will be the only time I ever produce a light attack trike. I need one to continue scouting. 
Harvester deployed. Construction complete. Atreides unit deployed. Acknowledged. Construction complete. <sighs> the heavy weapon factory produces track vehicles. Now we can build tanks. Also, you can see we can upgrade the factory for. Um, how are they called? MRWs? Or MPC? Anyway, it's a mobile base vehicle. MDV. And we have our first tank. The first of many. Oh, get away. Huh? Damn. These sandworms a mobile construction vehicle, yeah, that's it. Construction. So now that you've seen that, Report. I can explain further. See, the idea is, the Report. AI follows Report. a certain path, as I said, and as you have seen if you watched the last episode. Construction so, complete. the obvious strategy is the following. You just build a forward base right in their path, so that they have no choice but to run into your forward outpost. Construction complete. When they don't have a chance to even get close to your main base, you can combine both defense and offense. Reporting. Affirmative. Yes. Which is something that even Sun Tzu has declared a wise move, I think. Was it Sun Tzu? Or San Tzu? Whatever you're gonna call him. I think it was something like, the best defense is a strong Reporting. offense? Reporting. Yeah, anyway, that's what we're gonna do. Warning. Worms and with those sandworms around, that pre-spice mass bloom is not good for anything right now. Reporting. So we're just gonna Reporting. ignore it. We need more harvesters. This takes too long. Soon the AI will start attacking. I mean, we have to have more than one tank when that goes, when that starts, that goes on. Also, I have no idea, well, I have an idea, but, you know, I have this stupid program, not gonna say which one, and it just stop. it just asks for updates at the most random of times. Which happened right the moment when the Mentan was explaining the mission, so I had this very, very annoying sound right when he was talking, so I, I cut that out and told Cyril to repeat what he said. Which is why there was this small glitch in the briefing. So, don't worry, that's not something... Oh, enemy drop. So that's not something that will happen often. Harkonnen unit approaching. Our base is under attack. Construction complete. Reporting. And see, these troopers are the reason why House Harkonnen is so much stronger at this stage than the Atreides. Luckily, the AI is not able to comprehend that that little brown blob would save them from what's about to happen to them. Yes, squish them. Like this. And now we have a new harvester. Acknowledge. Now we have two new harvesters. That should do nicely. And we need more tanks. Harvester Reporting. We should also be getting some reinforcements soon. Hmm, here's a large spice field. This might be worth an expansion. Ah, there we go. Construction. A quad and unit deployed. And a tank. Reporting. Acknowledged. Ah, get away. Reporting. Don't you go away. Ah. No, 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 no. Oh, <sighs> those sandworms. And as you have seen, sandworms are even fast enough to eat a trike. So one mistake from those tanks and their worm food.
Which is also why I question the logic behind making tracked vehicles on a planet with giant worms that eat things that make rhythmic vibrations. Also, I'm not sure that tracked vehicles are the best for Sand Terran at all. I mean, tanks are heavy and sand is soft, so I don't know, shouldn't they sink in? Atreides Harvester deployed. If you're a researcher and you can answer this question, feel free to write a comment. Because I have honestly no, no idea. Yes, sir. Oh, that's one big rock. Warning. Looks better and better for a future expansion. Warning. Huh? It seems we found the, the route the enemy takes for attacking us. So we have to stop them before they get too close. I bet those stupid sandworms on the way. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. Hello. Now remember, Dune has a unit limit of 25, so no way will I fill my ranks with quads and trikes. We will build tanks non-stop. In this mission, tanks will be the only thing we require, and the only thing we will produce continuously. Now, Cyril would try to convince you otherwise. But strikes are only good for scouting, and quads have no further use at all. See, the tank can both shoot other tanks, shoot quads, destroy strikes, and most important of all, wish infantry. So, the trike and the quad lost almost all value as a tool of war. Construction. Where the dominant strategy part comes back in. Yes, sir. See, with the Arconan, those troopers, they have value. Because troopers en masse can destroy tanks easily. Atreides Harvester deployed. But those infantry, the Atreides use are just laughable. More tanks, please! Construction complete. So the sandworm goes up until there. Construction complete. Atreides. So this spice field is unsafe. Reporting. Which makes the spice field way to the west even more attractive. Harvester deployed. Since unlike Tiberium, in in Red Alert, the ore or, t or Tiberium in Tiberium Dawn, spice does not replenish. Also, new spice blooms don't pop up. So this spice field, in the southeast bottom, will be depleted soon. So an expansion to a new base is required for further profit. Reporting. Construction. Don't harvest there, idiot. He's so lucky the worm was occupied somewhere else. Construction complete. Unit. So now. I think... I think... Yeah, let's upgrade. It's time for a new base. And as I mentioned before, I will build the base on this rock. Close to this strike. Warning. Harkonnen uh -huh. approaching. Look at that! It, it seems we found Harkonnen Central. 
Yep, we did. Their base is right there. This is excellent. That track is of course lost. But you know it's just a track. Now look at this. More Harkonnen are coming in. And we reached our limit. Reporting. Oh, the sandworm ate something. But I don't care. See, we lost something, so now we have a spot for the MC MCP. Reporting. MCV, I really don't care. Mobile base construction vehicle. Reporting. Hmm, and you should be working. Acknowledged. Hmm. I have no idea what got eaten. Construction complete. Oh, it's done. See, I want to squish them, but that sandworm there... It's a real problem. So let's wait until those troopers are close. Our base is under attack. And now squish them. Warning. Worm sign. I noticed. Come on, come on. Don't you do it. Don't you do it. No. No. Oh. God damn it. Wait. That sandworm is gone. Oh, I forgot. They, they, they vanish after they ate three units. Like they're sated or they got enough heavy metal in their stomach. So this is our chance. Also, these troopers are yes, useless. Sir. This infantry. If they were troopers, they weren't useless. Construction complete. Stop him! Okay, they stopped him. Reporting. So with this sandworm gone, we can place our expansion here. You'll see, this will work nicely. Reporting. Acknowledged. I hope you don't mind that I sometimes just Reporting. stay silent because you know there's this reviewer Reporting. on that guy with the glasses called Warning. Film Film Brain. Uh, wait. More squishy squishy. Anyway, there's this guy called Film Brain. And his reviews are alright. But the thing is, he keeps Reporting. talking and talking and talking. He never stops. Yes, sir. I think it has something to do with the way he learned how to do reviews or the person that inspired him. There are some people on the internet that say that if you are a reviewer or a let's player, you must never stop talking. If you stop talking for too long, you're losing the audience. I disagree. See, the thing is, I think you people are watching this either because you like Dune or you like my commentary. So, or perhaps both. And if I just keep talking and talking and talking and talking, my commentary will eventually become annoying. Like film brains, film brains voice is sometimes to me. And Dune is still here, the music is there, the atmosphere is there, I don't have to talk over it all the time. Look at that! Sadukar! We gotta squish him! Squish him! Alright, little backstory. In, co in contrast to what I just said, I'm not that I'm not talking over the game all the time. Sadukar, or Sadokar, whatever you wanna pronounce them, are the Emperor's elite terror troops. They are superior to troopers in every way, and they deal real, real hard damage. I think it's like they're like infantry rocket launchers. Unlike the Harkonnen troopers who are just weak in comparison. Anyway, believe it or not, this is not a glitch, this is not a bug, this is story. 
the um, in the books, the Emperor lose, lures House Atreides to Dune in order to deal with the Duke, because the Duke is getting too popular in the Landsrat. The Landsrat is the sort of council of all noble houses in the known universe and the Padisha Emperor thrones above him. So House Atreides has become too popular and the Emperor feels threatened that the Atreides will try to take over and, and the Duke becoming the new Padisha. So, the, he hatched this ploy to lure House Atreides onto Dune by replacing the Harkonnen and then planning a sneak attack with the help of the Harkonnen and some Saddle Cartero troops, which are sworn elite units only at the Emperor's disposal, to eliminate the Atreides, and therefore a threat to him and the ancient enemy of House Arcone. That's how the book goes. In Dune 2 and Dune 2000, and Emperor, it goes like this. The Padisha Emperor, who is not the same Padisha Emperor as in the books and movie, plans a similar ploy. But this time, whichever house you play has become too strong and a threat to him. So he sends all three houses to Dune simultaneously so that they can kill each other off. And then, the moment you're losing, he would finish you off with his saddle car. However, of course, since you're the player and you're winning, obviously, uh, didn't pay the power bill. And since this plan doesn't work, since you're the player, of course, and you're way too smart for the AI, the Emperor gets desperate at this point and sends some Saduka terror troops to help watch whatever house you're fighting to finish you off. In this case, the Harkonnen got the aid. However, that of course is a real foolish move if you ask me, because everybody knows the Sadukars serve the Emperor. So now the Atreides know that Shaddam, or whatever his name is, is plotting against them. And as you can see, those four or five Sadukar terror troops really did not much terrorize anything. They just got squished. Squishy squishy. Report acknowledged. Construction complete. Reporting. Acknowledged. Reporting. Now we got the Harkonnen's undivided attention. Reporting. Construction complete. Affirmative. Reporting. So you see now our main base is pretty much untouched as long as we can stop them from getting past us. I will also create a heavy vehicle factory right here so that we can spawn reinforcements right at their doorstep. Which is what I meant by combining both offense and defense in one swift move. Yeah, he's still there. Uh, it is still there. Again, I don't know if sandworms have ganders. I don't think so. I left these two tanks here on purpose, by the way, just in case some troopers or one quad got through. Since we do not have any turrets yet. Turrets will be coming next mission, I think. Or perhaps the mission after number 5. Why aren't you a bold one? Ah, he's, he's retreating! Construction complete. You? Construction complete. I have to let him that. Smart for a Harkonnen. But now we got even more attention. But not to worry. We pretty much won already at this point. It's like fighting a snake, you have to control where the head is looking. Reporting. See, if the AI was smart, the enemy would understand that 
My forward base is just a way of stopping their advances and to push against them. So, um, he would try to attack me from behind. If this were a match against a human player, this strategy would not work. Or perhaps it would, by chance, but this is pretty much the main strategy for mission 3 and 4. Just Construction push. Complete. Construction complete. Stop their advance and push deployed. against them until you're standing right the at their doorstep. And then just run down the door and Reporting. splatter their hard common faces. Deployed. Reporting. I think we need more spice. We can never have enough spice. Harvester deployed. Reporting. Construction complete. Construction complete. A trading unit deployed. Oh damn. Don't you do that. Factories are expensive. Report acknowledged. Squish. Enemy unit destroyed. Enemy now of course. Destroyed. There are probably some people out there, out there that are way better in this game than I am, and they could win this without a single casualty. But see, the thing is, there is no repair facility, and remember that you can only have 25 units. So it is, in truth, the favor favorable thing to do, to destroy the units you got that are beyond saving. There's no point of keeping a tank around for score, when it's in the red. It's just taking up space you need for reinforcements, so just blow it up. Just send it in buy it and let it die. Reporting. Later then, when we get carry-alls in the repair facility, that will change. But at this point, there's nothing we can do and don't you dare. Reporting. Oh, it's too slow. Bye-bye. Worm attack. <sighs> Let's just build it here. We got a big spice field right right here, so let's build it reporting. there. Acknowledged. Enemy unit destroyed. Igno reporting. Acknowledged. Reporting. Affirmative. Reporting. Affirmative. Reporting. Acknowledged. So the Harkonnen seem to run out of defensive units. Reporting. See, the entire Harkonnen base is pre-programmed. The AI never expands. All their bases are pre-constructed. All the guard units are pre-placed. The only thing the AI does is to reproduce buildings that got destroyed. But you have to remember the age of this game. I mean, this was the first RTS game in the sense that we understand today. It was not the first. There was one before it. But I can't remember what the name was. <coughs> Sorry. Talking for 50 minutes straight is strenuous. Construction just give me a sec. <sighs> that should help a little. Affirmative. Reporting. Affirmative. Reporting. Affirmative. Reporting. Acknowledge. Reporting. Now this may seem all threatening, but there's Reporting. no point in being Reporting. threatened at this point. Reporting. There's no reason to be threatened Reporting. at this point. See? Reporting. We got our tank army right in front of them. Reporting. All they can do is defend. Affirmative. Yes, sir. Infantry out. Yeah. <laughs> Goodbye. Reporting. Reporting. I mean, maybe you disagree. Maybe you're one of those people that says, "What Film Brain does is the right thing to do. You should be talking constantly, without any pause." Maybe so, but that's just not the way 
I let's play. See, I'm not a reviewer. I'm a mere let's player at this point. And the thing is, if I do not have something to say, I simply do not have something to say. Sometimes the images explain everything by themselves. If there is something important to say, as you can tell, I will. Also here you can see the erosion part again, as mentioned in the last video. See, we had enough power. The, w the wind traps just eroded too far, so we had to repair, and power is up again. I will construct a new wind trap, just in case. Reporting. Reporting. Affirmative. Reporting. Affirmative. Reporting. Affirmative. Reporting. Affirmative. Reporting. Affirmative. Now we slowly encroach upon their territory, destroying what we can find. Reporting. And squishy, squishy. Affirmative. Construction complete. Acknowledged. Come on, tank master. Atreides harvester. Squish him. No remorse. Warning. Falconan unit approaching. Reporting. Atreides unit deployed. Acknowledge. Reporting. You see, the the AI Reporting. operates differently than us. Reporting. I think the programmers of this game really thought that quads could change the tide of battle. Or maybe they were just told. Because the AI wastes their unit numbers on both quads and troopers. Although troopers still have value. If used right. You will see what I mean when one day I will play as the Harkonnen and steamroll my enemies with lots of tanks and troopers. So we found the heavy weapon factory of House Harkonnen, which is one of our primary targets. Oh, and there are two tanks! Again, you might feel threatened from this image, but don't be. See, we got enough. Ah! Squishy, squishy! We got enough tanks to deal with this situation, and we can produce reinforcements right around the corner. There's no need to fear any of this anymore. We won. Enemy structure destroyed. See, I told you. The moment the first buildings go down, it's either in your favor, or a, or Reporting. You're losing. Acknowledged. Enemy unit destroyed. Reporting. Acknowledged. Reporting. Reporting. Warning. Parkonan unit approaching. Affirmative. Reporting. Acknowledged. Oh, we lost A one. Harvester deployed. Come on, squish him or blow him up. I don't care. Alright, they lost their heavy weapon factory. So no more tanks will be reproduced to annoy us. Now we have to kill the war. W-O-R. Where the troopers spawn out of. The quads are not our biggest concern. And the outpost isn't. Also. Reporting. 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 Enemy unit destroyed. Reporting. Affirmative. Enemy unit destroyed. Ah, that light factory will go down very soon. I think I mentioned this last Reporting. mission. The AI is trying to repair as much buildings as it can, however it cannot repair more than two at once. And the AI is not smart enough to tell which buildings are more important than others. See, it's, it's repairing 
Reporting. The power plant Reporting. and the radar outpost. Reporting. Affirmative. But it didn't repair the light vehicle factory. Enemy team destroyed. Affirmative. Enemy unit destroyed. Atreides unit deployed. Affirmative. Reporting. Affirmative. And this is pretty much how I won this mission when I was a kid. Reporting. Even back then I realized that the enemy, I'm sick of saying AI, that the enemy is just following one Reporting. path Reporting. over and over. And that if you step into that path, enemy structure destroyed. they are powerless to react. They cannot adapt, unlike you. Ah, see, he rebuilt that factory. Because I moved this tank. So the same rule as last mission. The moment you destroy a building, park something where that building was, or else the AI will rebuild it. That's it again, the enemy will rebuild it. But it won't last. See? Acknowledged. Reporting. Construction complete. Atreides unit deployed. Let's move something in there so that it can't be produced. Yes, that's good. Reporting. Now the war is the only thing left that produces Reporting. something threatening. Also, this tank is annoying. Acknowledged. Let's get him to attack with us, instead of attack us. Like this, watch. Ah, just a moment. See, now the Harkonnen tank will move to attack our tank. However, the fire will hit the refinery instead. Isn't that nice of him? Stupid Harkonnen. Ha. Oh, we lost someone. Team Stat Atreides is an Atreides sandwich. Reporting. Affirmative. Structure destroyed. And another structure taken care of. Acknowledged. Reporting. Acknowledged. Atreides team destroyed. Oh boy. Reporting. Affirmative. You know, in Emperor, when the... Oh look, they're retreating. <laughs> you know, in Emperor, when the enemy realizes that it's losing, they often just sell their entire base and send the remnants of their force in a suicide attack. But don't worry, they don't do that here. Acknowledged. Reporting. Enemy unit destroyed. And since my victory is so assured by this point, let's just get our backups up here as well and join in the massacre. Construction complete. Enemy unit destroyed. Atreides harvester deployed. You know, sadly, both in the movie and in Dune 2, the Emperor is portrayed as a complete imbecile. I mean, he, he really is an imbecile. You'll see. Construction complete. Construction complete. Ah, uh, should have destroyed that harvester. Now the enemy is getting more cash, which means the enemy can repair the buildings even more. So we have to destroy what's up here fast. However, without their construction yard, there is no risk of them rebuilding anything anymore, so we can move our tanks. Squishy, squishy! By the way, I again challenge you, the viewer, should you know a better strategy to win this, I'd love to see that. 
You know, if you say, "Oh, what you're doing, Dark? That's that's not the best strategy Warning. to win." If you know some miracle strategy Warning. to win the day, show me or explain it. You know, you can either write a comment or post a video response. It would be interesting to see if there's someone out there who has a better answer to the enemy's quirks and strategies. I mean, I didn't rush or anything, I just tried to win, you know, in my own time. I know I could have gone faster, or oh, built more harvesters or whatever. Atreides unit destroyed. I was just playing like usual, like like I did when I was a kid. Enemy unit destroyed. Acknowledged. Reporting. Affirmative. Yeah, he still got one more unit of troopers, are. Reporting. But we're in the home stretch now. Don't worry. Affirmative. Reporting. Construction complete. Atreides unit deployed. Enemy unit destroyed. Atreides unit deployed. Report. Affirmative. Sea walls do have some value. But only in this mission. Acknowledged. In the next mission we get the rocket tank. Basically a mobile rocket launcher. Affirmative. So walls lose their value to almost all degrees. And more squishy squishy. You know, if I would give Dune two episodes titles, the title of this episode would be Squishy Squishy. But I don't. I just name them after the mission. So this is mission four. In case you're wondering, there are nine missions for each house. Okay, this is really, really over. No more spies. No more power. No more construction yard. This is done. Reporting. Acknowledged. Reporting. Affirmative. Report. Acknowledged. Reporting. Acknowledged. You know, I'm sorry if I'm not as talk active or inspiring or whatever as I'm usually but it's really really hot here and I'm tired it was a long day it has something to do with the reason why Dune is coming out on Wednesday instead of Tuesday as it usually does don't worry next mission uh, next mission will come out next Tuesday and we won your mission is complete. Well done! No task seems too difficult for you. The Harkonnen will think twice before attacking our harvesters again. Yeah, I'm sure Cyril is out on his motorcycle right now, playing some Yu-Gi-Oh! Card games on motorcycles. And now, let's go on at the Emperor's Palace. You of all people should understand the importance of victory. Yes, Your Excellency, I. You let the Atreides defeat you and my Sadukar! I did not let I will not allow it to happen again! And with this humanist cutscene and no further background music, I leave you here at the card selection screen, and we will see we will see each other next week, hopefully in a better condition. Until then, the spice must flow. Remember that. The sleeper must awaken.